Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will troubleshoot this issue. Startup repair could not repair your PC. Okay, whatever error you are getting, like automatic repair could not repair your PC, your PC did not start correctly. So these are all the errors related to the startup errors. So we will hit the some commands to repair these errors. So first of all, these are the main reasons behind this error. Like first one is Windows corruption, second one is back bed sector inside a hard drive, third one is sudden hardware changes, or the fourth one is corrupted boot files inside your Windows. Okay, once you are on a this screen, startup repair or whatever option you are getting, click on advanced options, click on troubleshoot, again click on advanced options. And if you are not able to access the PC like this, you need to restart your system two to three times forcefully. Okay. Click on command prompt. The first command you need to type as chkdsk space the drive letter, the where is the Windows install. It is usually installed in the C drive, but in my case, it is installed in D, then colon space slash F and hit enter. Once you hit enter, you will see the message like this. It will go in a five stages and repair all the bad sectors as well as the corruption files. So wait for the process to complete. Once this command is completed, you need to type an exit and click on continue with Windows 10. If your issue is solved, then well and good. If not, again, Come on same screen, click on troubleshoot, click on advanced options and this time we will click on this option, the startup setting. We will hit some command in the safe mode so that our PC can repair. Click on startup setting and restart your PC here. Okay, here you need to type F4 on your keyboard to enable safe mode. Press F4. Now PC is going to safe mode. If you are not able to access the PC in a safe mode, I will show other command to repair your PC as well. So let's wait. Okay, this is the safe mode screen. You need to go to search bar, type for PowerShell. Okay and run it as an administrator with the right click. Type the command SFC space slash scan now. SFC stands for system file checker which scan all the corruption inside your windows and repair those. But windows resource protection could not start the repair service. In my case this command is not working but you can try this command okay. Once you are a safe mode, go to control panel. Open control panel. And select here the large icons here. After that, click on programs and feature options. And uninstall the program which is causing the issue. And once you uninstall that, you need to exit out from here. And press window plus R button together. Type for MS config as shown on the screen and click on OK button. After that, go to services tab here. Okay, and then click on hide all Microsoft services. Once you click on that, click on disable. Okay, click on apply, click on OK, and restart your system in a normal mode. Restart your system in a normal mode and your issue will be fixed. If your issue is still not fixed, we will hit some more commands here. Click on troubleshoot and this time we will repair the boot files. Click on advanced options, click on command prompt. Select your account here. Account you should choose the admin one. Now you need to type for boot rec space slash scan OS and hit enter. Once you hit enter, it will scan all the corruption inside your operating system. So 
so let's wait now the operation is completed successfully you need to tap her boot boot track space slash fix mbr fix mbr and hit enter after that boot track space slash fix boot okay after that if you get the access is denied i will link a video you can watch that after that type boot track space slash rebuilt bcd and this command will rebuild the boot files hit enter now completed successfully type exit and click on continue windows 10 or 11 and your issue will be fixed so hope your issue is fixed if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching